Hold up. You want one alive? Oh, kind of hard to run tests on something dead. Here. What, what, what is that? It's a special tranquilizer. It'll help you knock it out long enough so you can bring it back here. I am so close, Deacon. This could be it. Yes, ma'am. Deacon, come in. Hey, I was yep. just heading out to find you a newt. Great. Okay, there's a specific one that I need, all right? Well, wait, hold on for a second. A specific newt? South of here, just off Rim Drive, is an old resort cabin. It's now home to an entire colony of infected kid newts. Okay. Okay, so radio me when you get there. Sarah, out. <laughs> colony of newts. Oh, my God, this I gotta see. Our colony, you say. St. John, report. Hey, Captain. I'm on a run for Lieutenant Whitaker, so I'm kind of busy at the moment. Understood. Report to me when you're finished. I'm ready to test Beaver's weapon. Corey out. <sighs> Shit. Oh, so much for Sarah beating Weaver to the finish line. Sarah, I'm here. All right. You're looking for a young female wearing a red shirt. One of those kids' shirts that says, like, Teensy Tabby or something. I'm surprised the Colonel hasn't burned this place out yet. I told Matt the site was hands off. I've been running blood tests on several of the young ones. I need them for the serum. Okay, uh, how am I supposed to get the one that you want without killing the rest? Look, I don't know, just... Just do what you have to do, okay? I need the female wearing the red shirt. Why specifically, though? There we go. Well, he really meant calling me. Out of these fuckers. Got you, you little shit. Oh, Jesus. Come on, here come the rest. Newts, I wonder if they got anything in their nest. I mean, I would tie it up personally, but that's just me. You want an alive one? You get a live one. Oh, fucking Jesus Christ. Uh. Hey, Captain, uh, pistol over my bike. Uh, the Colonel doesn't allow for pets on the island, I'm afraid. <laughs> uh, Lieutenant needed a live test subject. Uh, you two seem to be getting along well. You and Lieutenant Whitaker? Just doing my job, sir. You know, keep it professional, Corporal. The Colonel doesn't allow for fraternization between enlisted men and officers. Oh, no, no. I can't have any of that, sir. All right. Carry on. Yes, sir. <coughs> okay. <sighs> Come on, help me! <laughs> so much for the tranquilizer. Yeah, well, the biology's kind of fucked right now. What do you want me to do? I can't get the right dosage. Here, hold on, hold on. This is what I've been working on. How long? Hold on, just a few seconds. You killed it? Oh, shit.
Well, whew, I don't know what you put in that. That shit went down fast. God damn it! Not successful. But you, you, you're not making a bioweapon. You're. Oh my god! Are you, are you, are you trying to cure it? I thought that once I got the original cell line from Cloverdale, that I could create antibodies for the virus, and I could reverse engineer it. Jesus. And now all of that work. Everything that I have worked on is for nothing. I can't save them. Nothing's going to be able to change them back. So get up, dust yourself off, try again. Are you not seeing what just happened? Every cell in that kid's body just exploded. That's exactly why you can't quit. What? Because you called it a kid. Do you have any idea how many of these things that I've killed? And it never once occurred to me, you know what, that used to be someone's kid. You know, I met this girl once, and she used to talk about the freakers the same way you do. She used to call them sick people. I thought that was crazy, but she looks at them the same way you do. So you think I'm crazy? No, no. I think you're the first sane person I've seen in two years. You know, I still remember the night that I lost you, but I'm starting to realize it wasn't the night that I had left you on that chopper. It was the next night. Me and Boozer, we rode into that refugee camp that you were supposed to be waiting at, right? Except there's freakers everywhere. The choppers are on fire. There's people screaming, so many people. And so we fought, and we won, and what did we get? Bodies. Bodies everywhere. And I checked every corpse, every face. There must have been a thousand of them, maybe more. I checked every single one. That was the night that I lost. And Boozer. Boozer, you know, he's, <laughs> he's just, he was just trying to keep me together for the next two years. But I didn't give a shit about any of it. And then I see this Nero chopper flying around in the sky and I start to feel something I'm thinking you know what fuck you fuck you because even if she is alive you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna find her we're gonna ride away we're never gonna look back because I don't want to be part of some militia I don't want to fight no war and I don't want to live in some camp so why are you still here because of you all of this seeing how hard you work seeing how dedicated you are most people out there are just trying to survive and here you are trying to save the goddamn world not doing a very good job. So you get up, you dust yourself off, and you try again. We're going back to Cloverdale. They got better equipment. We're going to dig into their research deeper. You would do that. You would help me. Yeah, I would. I would because you believe in this. Oh, man. We'll ride north. Yeah, we'll ride north. We'll, we'll tell them that we're going on a supply run. Yeah, but we're not coming back. No, we're gonna go AWOL. Oh, shit. For real this time. You know if they catch us, they will hang us. Then we hang together. Ma'am? <clears throat> yeah. Deke. Colonel wants to see you. Be right there. Pack up what you need, I'll be back. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Corporal St. John. Colonel, sir. Come with me, please. What's up, Colonel? Are we ready? Colonel, sir. Yes, sir. That shit is locked and loaded. Oh, bike's already loaded, sir. I'm not sure if I understand. Lieutenant Weaver's weapon is finished. We're ready to test it. Hell yeah. Are you ready to burn down a horde? Oh, 
something wrong, Corporal? No, sir. No, no, no. Um, hell yeah. Let's get this done. All right. Now you're talking, man. Gentlemen, this is the start of a new era. Carry on. Lieutenant Weaver, with me. Yes, sir. We're going to go burn down a horde, huh? I figured that I think should... you should stay up here and let me do this alone. What the fuck? You got a death wish? No. That's why I think I should go in alone. Look, even with Weaver's jacked up Molotovs, we can't take an entire horde all at once. No. So, uh... All right, I figure I go down there. I get their attention. I pull off a few at a time, and then I run like hell. And I gotta find some way to slow them down, maybe set a few traps. And then I blow him to hell. Look, two of us running around down there. It's gonna be chaos. We'll just pull the horde down on each other. No, you stay up here. You keep an eye on me. If shit goes south, you ride in there, you get me the hell out. Hmm? Unless you got a better plan. I got nothing. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. I'm better off alone. Got more Molotovs. Ammo in my saddlebags. Good, good. Uh, shit's gonna come in handy. Yeah, Ammo-wise, I'm pretty good. Full on ammo now. Now I'm full on everything, okay. You're full of that. All right, so I gotta go there and kill that horde. Tell me your plan again. Like I said, find a way to slow them down. The sons of bitches like to clump up, climb all over each other. If I can find a narrow space between trucks, buildings, whatever, it'll take them a while to get through. But once I get some space between me and them, you'll blow them the hell up. You got it. Rinse, repeat, uh, a few times. No more horde. That's right. your plan. I'm heading in. Good luck, Saint I see you. Let me know if you need my help. Oh, it's got nothing to do with it. Fire. I'll take us most, as many silently as possible. Where the fuck did the horde go? Oh, they're there. Here's the horde. Exactly there. Oh, 
Oopsie, a lot more that way. Shitty one. I saw how fast that horde went down when I threw those Molotovs. The napalm sticks to each other, you know? Hurry, please. Please just tell me that's all of them. I can't believe it. You did it. You wiped out an entire horde. Yeah, I did, baby. Yeah, no problem. No problem. It's another Sarah, good day's work. Uh, Lieutenant Whitaker, this is Corporal St. John, reporting in. Come back. Oh, where the hell are you? Captain, uh, I just tried to check in with Lieutenant Whitaker, and she's not answering. Couldn't wait to tell her the good news? Yeah, she'll be thrilled. I bet. You'll see her soon enough. Don't radio Lieutenant Weaver. I want to tell him the news in person. Okay, you earned that. <laughs> Copy that. St. John out. I don't know where we are. Useful. Pick up all this shit for sure. Yeah. Yeah, that was a big old horde. Gonna pick up all these. Oh, we're good. Let's head back up. See, that would have been useful while running away from the horde, but I didn't run out of stamina running away from the horde, though. That was pretty good on stamina. I didn't run out of stamina until I started collecting the bounties. We did it. You did it. Uh, we were did it. Oh. I've never seen anything like this. When the way you were one step ahead of them? Ever had a horde breathing down your neck? It really keeps the adrenaline flowing. Maybe the colonel's right. Maybe we can win this war. Hey! How'd it go? Oh, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. Oh, shit. It didn't work? Oh, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. But you're out of a job. Hell yeah, it was. Oh, yeah! <laughs> you should have been there, man. We really lit them up. Oh, man! We're gonna celebrate tonight. The office is mess. <laughs> All right. Looks like somebody's getting a promotion. Hey, man, you coming? Yeah. Uh, you know what? Let me, I'm gonna catch up. B. I gotta, I gotta take care of something first. All right, you handle that. That's the last of it. Be careful not to break anything. Not me. Some of these things are... irreplaceable. What's going on? Uh... Where is the lieutenant? Corporal St. John, I'm sorry, sir. It's all right, son. All essential personnel doing R&D have been moved. Moved? Where? Uh, because I need to deliver these supplies that she asked for. I understand. There's... been a... Walk with me, son. Please. Colonel's orders. Matt, you can't do this. You can't keep me locked in here. At ease, Captain. 
And then the Lord said to Noah, Enter the ark, you and all your household, for you alone I have seen to be righteous before me in this time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, you, Lieutenant. You can't! Colonel, wait! Hey! It's fine. It's fine. Ma'am, I got the, uh, supplies that you asked for. Come on in. Follow me. I've been working on a new assignment. Poison this time. Hmm. Listen. When you pick this, you have to do it carefully. If you don't, it could kill you. Understood. I'm gonna get you out of here. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. St. John. Oh, damn, man. He's locking up, uh... I'm here, Captain. Locking up his captain. Colonel has asked to see you. You'll find him in his chambers inside the Ark. Oh, his chambers? If you go in from the main camp, past the first storage area, there's a passage off... Oh, I just... I don't hey, know what Weaver. I just did. Oh, Corporal St. John. Come on in, man. Check out my home sweet home. Yeah, what would you have done with the place? Man, ain't I... this some shit? Wonder what they would have done with me if I failed. No, colder cave down that way. Yeah, I heard about that. You know, she didn't take it any better than I did. No, she did not. Do you need anything? Nah, man, I'm good. Oh wait, you know what? There is something you can get from me. You hear that? Hear what? That's right. Nothing. Colonel ain't exactly big on tunes. In case you hadn't heard. Isn't like music. I think it's a Mennonite or some shit. Oh, it's dancing. Wait, what's? Dude, Mennonites, they love music. They just have a problem with dancing. Forget it. Oh, it's... no shit. Yeah, whatever, dude. I don't care. I need an MP3 player. Earbuds. Anything. Sounds. Are you kidding me? Do I look like I'm kidding? Okay. Thank you. Oh, well, I need... Hey, sir, you there? Come in. Corporal St. John, I won't tolerate insubordination. Private, I'm trying to work. Get out. Sorry, ma'am. Colonel's orders. You gotta keep eyes on you 24 7. Uh, Lieutenant, I'm sorry. Yeah, just reporting in. Um, I got a question about your requisition form. Yes, Corporal. Uh, it says that you need me to collect water hemlock. Yes. It grows along the edges of wetlands. Look along the north edge of the Klamath Marsh. You should be able to find it there. Klamath Marsh. Got it. Remember, Corporal, it's highly poisonous. The most toxic plant that grows in North America. O okay, I'll be careful. And the last report said that there were infected crows in the area, so you might want to take something to burn out their nests. I already done that. Burn out their nests. Got it. Uh, one more thing. Uh, that other project that I'm working on? Rattler. I'm going to have more information on that soon. Thank you, Corporal. Holly Styrene. Lieutenant Whitaker out. I got any. Every time uh, I think sir, their I conversation's was, over, you know, when I was it is. Young, we used to explore caves like these, looking for petroglyphs, carvings by the Modoc, other tribes, thousands of years old. You know, they never lived in these caves, the heathen. In the cold and the dark. But look at us. Look how far we have fallen. Uh, Colonel, Colonel, I, I was... The soldier who used to be assigned to Lieutenants Whitaker and Weaver, the soldier you replaced, has gone AWOL. He broke into my private chambers and took my personal copy of the Holy Bible. I want it returned. Yes, sir. I've marked his last known location on your map. Dismissed, Corporal. How far have we fallen? So much shit going on here that I just can't figure out what I'm doing. <laughs> what is this? Bounty Hunter? Oh, this is that.
Yep, oh, wait, isn't this uh, Sarah's? What is this? Wait, it's just up this way. Oh no, it's probably down there. I'm an idiot. Uh, one of those speeches. A short while ago, I stood here before you and grieved for the loss of Captain Menes, our only doctor and my very dear friend. And for what great purpose did Captain Jimenez perish? So that a drug addict, a worthless excuse of a human being, could get high. Jimenez died because he stood between a junkie and a bag full of narcotics. Yeah. 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 I have taken steps to see that this never happens again. For their own safety, I have moved Lieutenants Whitaker and Weaver into the Ark where they will be under protective watch 24 hours a day. Oh, damn. That's why they got moved, okay. The call is going out. Any person who has highly trained knowledge and skills, skills that cannot be replaced, mechanics, engineers, scientists, medical personnel, are to be taken from active duty and removed to the Ark until this war is over. From now on, no one is allowed entrance into the Ark unless they are on special assignment and unless they are personally vetted by myself. There will be no exceptions. I am beginning to see, I'm afraid, that our enemy has never been the freaks. They know not what they do. Mankind, in all his state of degradation and transgression, is our true enemy. Keep a watchful eye on your neighbors. Evil surrounds us. One religious not in charge of an army. <laughs> Uh, let's head down to the way over here. Let's see if I can find these last two things, but I really don't see a place I could search. We just have to use a guide and find them. Fucks. Hey, Deke. Hey, man. I saw you ride out with the Wizard Island Witch the other day. How'd that go? You mean Lieutenant Whitaker, Sergeant? Oh, hey, no, I, I didn't mean nothing. I'm just, just us grunts here, right? Shooting the shit? Yeah, we'll show some respect. Yeah, yeah, like I said, I, I didn't mean nothing. And I'll be talking no shit. See you, Corporal St. John. Corporal St. John. Sarge, good to see you. There you go. Okay, yeah. Every little bit helps, yeah? Yeah, gonna make me a quadrillionaire, right? <laughs> okay, now that's more like it. All right. Yeah, okay. Hey, Corporal St. John. I'll catch you later. Corporal Deacon St. John. All right, calm down. Hey, Sarge. <laughs> 
All right, so our missions are over here. I'm actually not going to go do those missions. I'm going to call it quits here, but I just want to go hand some stuff in here real quick. Call it quits. St. John, you there? Weaver, yeah. I can barely hear you, though. You're breaking up. For St. John. Damn, Let hey, him in. Man. I'm surprised the signal gets out at all. Hey, I know where you can find an MP3 player. Whereabouts? Okay, yeah, where's that? I was at a refugee camp at a community college when it got overrun. Community College, uh, the one east of here off Highway 97? Yeah, that's the one. Home with the fighting platypus or some shit. Yo, anyway, when I bugged out, I left everything behind, including my tunes. Oh, shit, I gotta go. Radio me when you get there. Weaver out. Uh, sure, Weaver, whatever you say. You have bounties, yes? I have plenty of bounties, ma'am. All right. Oof, 5,000 away. Mother, stop. Yeah, I've ever actually seen it first. That's all I got for now. So close. It's so far. Do you have a mission for me? Oh, was it? Corporal Dinkins, St. John. Good, good to see you. Okay, Serge. Yeah, I'm right not level then. three yet, man. I'm so close, but Co so far. Corporal St. John, I'll, I'll see you around. Yeah. Hey, Corporal. All right, save the game. All right, ladies and gentlemen, there we have it. I'm going to call it quits right here. It's been like a three-ish hour session, I want to say. Maybe closer to four. Um, but I had a lot of crashes in the beginning. Then eventually, I changed my settings down from very high to high, which I don't think actually made a difference because I've been playing on very high this entire time without problems until I reached this area, the Crater Lake region, and then it started crashing a lot. But after it crashed for the last time, I restarted my PC and then got back into the game. It hasn't crashed once since then. I was able to play almost three hours now without a single crash so uh yeah i have no idea <laughs> but uh that is it for that i hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you guys next time peace out <laughs>